The Karamandal Coast is the southeastern coast region of the Indian subcontinent, bounded by the Utkal Plains to the north, the Bay of Bengal to the east, the Kaveri Delta to the south, and the Eastern Ghats to the west, extending over an area of about 22,800 square kilometres. Its definition can also include the northwestern coast of the island of Sri Lanka. The coast has an average elevation of 80 metres and is backed by the Eastern Ghats, a chain of low, flat-topped hills. Etymology Koromandal is the Dutch pronunciation of Kariminal, a village in the Sriharikota island in the north of Pazavarkadu Pulkat Lake. Pazavarkadu Pulkat was an early Dutch settlement along with Masulaputnam in present-day Andhra Pradesh. There is a Dutch cemetery belonging to the 17th century at Pulkat. It is said that the first Dutch ship stopped here for fresh drinking water, and upon asking the name of the place Kariminal was spelled as Korimondal K replaced with C and D inserted, the land of the Chola dynasty was called Cholamandalam Kola Mantalam in Tamil, literally translated as the realm of the Cholas, from which the Portuguese derived the name Karamandal. The name could also be derived from Karumandalam, meaning the realm of the Kurus. Topic. Description. Topic. Economy Agriculture is the mainstay of the coastal economy. Rice, pulses legumes, sugarcane, cotton, and peanuts groundnuts are grown. Bananas and betel nuts are grown together with rice in the low rainfall region of the interior. There are casuarina and coconut plantations along the coast. Large-scale industries produce fertilizers, chemicals, film projectors, amplifiers, trucks, and automobiles. There is a heavy vehicle and armored car factory at Avidai and a nuclear power station at Kalpakam. Roads and railways linking Chennai, Kudalur, Chidambaram, Chengalpattu, and Puducherry run parallel to the coast. Geography The coast is generally low, and punctuated by the deltas of several large rivers, including the Kaveri, Pilar, Penner, and Krishna River, which rise in the highlands of the western Ghats and flow across the Deccan Plateau to drain into the Bay of Bengal. The alluvial plains created by these rivers are fertile and favor agriculture. The rivers remain dry during most of the year. There is little forest cover, but marshes, swamps, scrub woodlands, and thorny thickets are common. The coastline forms a part of Tamil Nadu and Andhra Pradesh. The important ports include Chennai, Thuthukudi, Nellar, Ennore and Nagapatanam, which take advantage of their close proximity with regions rich in natural and mineral resources and good transport infrastructure. Topic. Climate The Karamandal coast falls in the rain shadow of the Western Ghats mountain range, and receives a good deal less rainfall during the summer southwest monsoons, which contributes heavy rainfall in the rest of India. The region averages 800 mm per year, most of which falls between October and December. The topography of the Bay of Bengal, and the staggered weather pattern prevalent during the season favors northeast monsoons, which have a tendency to cause cyclones and hurricanes rather than a steady precipitation. As a result, the coast is hit by inclement weather almost every year between October and January. The high variability of rainfall patterns is also responsible for water scarcity and famine in most areas not served by the great rivers. For example, the city of Chennai is one of the driest cities in the country in terms of potable water availability, despite high percentage of moisture in the air, due to the unpredictable, seasonal nature of the monsoon. Flora The Karamandal coast is home to the East Deccan Dry Evergreen Forests ecoregion, which runs in a narrow strip along the coast. Unlike most of the other tropical dry forest biome regions of India, where the trees lose their leaves during the dry season, the East Deccan Dry Evergreen Forests retain their leathery leaves year-round. The Karamandal coast is also home to extensive mangrove forests along the low-lying coast and river deltas, and several important wetlands, notably Kalivli Lake and Pulikat Lake, that provide habitat to thousands of migrating and resident birds. History 
By late 1530 the Caramandel coast was home to three Portuguese settlements at Nagapatanam, São Tomé de Meliapur, and Pulicat. In the 17th and 18th centuries, the Caramandel coast was the scene of rivalries among European powers for control of the India trade. The British established themselves at Fort St. George Madras and Masulapatnam, the Dutch at Pulicat, Sadras and Kovlong, the French at Pondicherry, Karakal and Nizamputnam, the Danish in Dansborg at Tharangambadi. The Karamandal coast supplied Indian Muslim eunuchs to the Thai Palace and Court of Siam modern Thailand. The Thai at times asked eunuchs from China to visit the court in Thailand and advise them on court ritual since they held them in high regard. Eventually, the British won out, although France retained the tiny enclaves of Pondicherry and Karakal until 1954. Chinese lacquer goods, including boxes, screens, and chests, became known as Karamandal goods in the 18th century, because many Chinese exports were consolidated at the Karamandal ports. Two of the famous books on the economic history of the Karamandal Coast are Merchants, Companies, and Commerce on the Karamandal Coast, 1650–1740 Arisaratnam, Oxford University Press, 1986 and The World of the Weaver in Northern Karamandal, c. 1750c.1850 p. Swarnalatha, Orient Longman, 2005. On 26 December 2004, one of the deadliest natural disasters in modern history, the Indian Ocean earthquake, struck off the western coast of Sumatra Indonesia. The earthquake and subsequent tsunami reportedly killed over 220,000 people around the rim of the Indian Ocean. The tsunami devastated the Karamandal coast, killing many and sweeping away many coastal communities. Topic. Applications of the name Four ships of the Royal Navy have borne the name HMS Karamandal after the Indian coast. The Karamandal Peninsula in New Zealand was named after one of these ships, and the town of Karamandal, New Zealand was named after the peninsula. Karamandal Valley, South Australia, and its neighbouring suburb, Karamandal East, gain their name from the ship Karamandal, which arrived in Holfast Bay from London in 1837 with 156 English settlers. After the ship reached the shore, some of its sailors deserted, intending to remain behind in South Australia, and took refuge in the hills in the Coromandel Valley region. A red nail varnish made by Chanel is named Coromandel due to its suggestions of exoticism. One of the earliest superfast trains of Indian railways that runs between Howrah and Chennai is named Coromandel Express. In Slovene the idiom India Koromandia India Karamandal means a land of plenty, a promised land, a utopia where houses are bleached with cheese and covered with cake. In literature The 1955 historical novel Karamandal, by John Masters describes a young English adventurer arriving in the 17th century at the Karamandal coast. He is the founder of the Savage family, whose descendants live during British rule in India and appear in other books of Masters series. There is a well-known poem by the Indian poet and freedom fighter Sarojini Naidu titled Karamandal Fishers. The little-known early 20th century poet Walter J. Turner wrote a poem titled Karamandal. The Courtship of the Yangi Bongi Bo by Edward Lear is set on the coast of Karamandal. Caramandal Wood is referred to by Dame Edith Sitwell in her poem, Black Mrs. Behemoth, part of Facade. She likens the wood's grain to the rolling, curling smoke of a blown-out candle. Sir Osbert Sitwell Dame Edith's brother composed a poem titled, On the Coast of Caramandal. Caramandal Sea Change is a 1991 novel by Rumor Godden about a diverse group of guests staying at a hotel on the Caramandal coast during an election campaign. The coast is noted in MMK's novel The Far Pavilions. A work of fiction, the lead character, Ashton Hillary Akbar Pelham Martin, retires to the Karamandal coast early in the tale. See also Malabar Coast Presidency of Karamandal and Bengal Settlements References World Statesman. Org, India Topic. External links 
Media related to Coromandel Coast at Wikimedia Commons Encyclopædia Britannica, Coromandel Coast, region, India.